Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do your 72 hour um, general reading. So we've got cards pulled for love and romance, career and finance. Um, <clears throat> so I pull the cards for the sake of time, of course. Uh, I want to thank those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. Make sure you are commenting below. Um, I think that's it for announcements, right? All links are below. If you want to get a reading just like this of your own to know what the next 72 hours hold for you, you can book and the link is below, okay? And that reading is on sale. Also, the 30-minute phone reading is on sale if you want to take advantage of that. So let's get into it. So for love, we have at the bottom of the deck the five of water. So we have some things not turning out how either Aquarius wanted them to turn out maybe in regards to love and romance or how the other person that you come into this reading, how they feel about the the divide, the division, the change uh, that is or was your relationship. Um, there's somebody too stuck on what is and what and what was not what happened someone can't move forward you know this is also hesitating before making a, a necessary decision to either move forward uh reduce the energy and try to figure out the root of the issue whatever you're going to do there needs to be movement here uh this is someone who's stuck this is someone who's stuck in grief Okay, and you may be grieving a loss. And uh, my con uh, my condolences to those who are. Okay, some of you just don't know how to get over a broken heart is what I'm hearing. No, you don't know how to move forward. You don't know how to maybe accept the rejection or the, um, the breakdown, the demise of the situation. And you're just stuck there. Okay, so love... In romance, we have the Queen of Air, we have the Three of Earth, we have the Two of Fire, and then we have the Page of Fire. So, all in all, I think Aquarius is showing up. Is showing up as the woman with the or a man. With a lot of experience, a lot of life experience, a lot of really trying to find reason in what is happening, why it's happening in their life. Trying to find the clarity, trying to get through the mystery of why is this not for me? Why hasn't this happened for me? Why did this happen to me? Uh, and, and trying not to be... Uh, so jaded you know um the three of earth there's an aquarius who is also contemplating moving forward and rebuilding what they found was stable for themselves like this is someone who has completely been thrown a loop in love in regards to this could be someone who is a part of a third party situation who was a part of a third party situation can't for the life of them understand why they still think about the situation why they would even want to be with this person also this is someone who says why wasn't I chosen? You know, why didn't I get the recognition that I deserve? There's also someone at a, a crossroads in regards to this partnership. Once again, wanting someone wanting to re either rebuild with the Aquarius or Aquarius wants to rebuild with this person. It looks like a message of taking action and doing something. Um, that puts you guys in a place of maybe exploring, you know, rebuilding uh, comes in for you. 
some of you did a lot of work a lot of manifestation uh, magic work you know in regards to maybe bring this partnership back together so you could continue to move forward some of you have done a lot of work to bring an actual soulmate in some of you um, yeah that's pretty much what a lot of you have done it's like you've done the work on yourself you've done the work in regards to bringing someone else in also So let's see what the shells have to say. Wow, the first shell is magic. It's I mean, it, you know, it's pretty evident in the cards. It's like some some of my Aquarius are really learned, are really, you know, knowledgeable about themselves, about life, about uh, the the magic of um, of uh, the law of attraction and, and and so forth and maybe even moon magic candle magic fire magic just really trying to be um as productive as possible in regards to bringing that person that person in there might be someone missing you there might be an element of that also let's see career some of you just have really just kind of shifted focus into career while still you know waiting for that perfect person forgive yes yeah, someone is um stuck someone wants to give you a message you're not sure you will forgive them closure okay hell some of you <laughs> some of you gonna forgive have closure and you, you come out of that hell. hell hell for some of us is redundance or, or being redundant uh, repetitive uh, situations where you just never learn the lesson you just continue to can repeat repeat um, was that Saturnian lesson you, you never learn the life lesson the 12th house you never come to the, the closure the culmination of some of you are doing that you've learned lesson with particular person or persons and now you're moving forward and you're really trying to bring in some real good um, much needed and deserved energy into your life you've done the magic and you some of you either have the closure or you're having the closure or whatnot okay uh, the angel and oh, wow the angel answers says don't stop whatever it is you're doing don't stop because at the bottom of the angel answers that we have a yes answer yes to whatever question you have and yes we do clarify our yes answers here at the channel and we'll get a chance to do that but don't stop it's like you're very on fire in regards to learning about yourself once again learning the root of the problem what part you played in it how you need to fix self then move forward then do the manifestation work to bring yourself back to a whole person then and then look at you know partnership and bringing those new um partnerships into your life that you're ready for because you have done the work so for some of you that that is the energy here for love so let's uh let's go ahead and clarify this yes answer what's this yes answer for aquarius and for love love and romance the yes answer thank you thank you thank you lord god bless all right prince of cups yes you might have princess of cups you may have someone new while wow, the will of fortune at the bottom of the deck you have someone new come in just in time, just in the nick of time, the right time. You you have shifted the energy. You have shifted your luck. You have got the wheel turning because you got behind knowing thyself, correcting thyself, and then being ready for partnership 
the wheel is turning in your favor luck is on your side keep in mind you don't control luck but luck is with you there could be a new person that you could eventually fall in love with a new relationship a spiritual insight here being more spiritually grounded where spirit can speak to you about well hey you might need to work on you know possessiveness uh, communicating whatever it is you know um, or, or spirit may be telling you that a particular person is for you I'm just heard that so then so yes we have someone new coming in and we have a new love it's going to be in the it could be around the Sagittarius time so what's that November December something is coming or someone is coming in for you this is really good they could be a fire sign it could be anybody we got all signs here so don't get caught up on that all right for career and finance at the bottom of the deck we have judgment it says the past is over live in the present this is where you are where you are right now get used to it get comfortable in it learn how to grow it whatever it may be for you um but you also have to change this is change of a lifestyle okay uh because it's maybe your career path has changed maybe something shifted maybe you're reviving something maybe there's something been there's something inside of you there's been something inside of you for a very very long time maybe a, a life a lifetime that you repressed right and now spirit is asking you to bring it to the surface bring it up bring it back this may be a very emotional time for you three of cups you're very you're highly sensitive around people and energy very discerning and stern you may even come off judgmental but that's only because you can really read read people to the core of them not to the you know not to detriment but you just you just have it in you you can't get away from it even if you try Okay, so career finance, two of pentacles, eight of pentacles, page of wands, knight of pentacles. Then I say, so this is something where, first of all, this is a situation where that you have, you have juggled. This is a business idea. Uh, this is another job. This is another career sector you juggle. You played around with. You picked it up and you put it down, and then you did something else, and then you came back to it, and then you came. Then you said, maybe I'll go to school and learn about it, or maybe I'll just work really hard where I am. Uh, but I can't get away from this thing, right? This thing that I've repressed for a while. It's it is being asked to to re, re, uh, be revived um, in my life the, the knight of pentacles is here it says that you can have some real stability with this thing whatever it may be new career path new job something uh, a new t a talent that you have and you need to foster um, yeah maybe a business idea that you you picked up and then you put down this says you need to honor this your a guardian angel has been with you speaking with you about this this is for you whatever it may be it says that you need to commit to it because you can have some really some real stable energy money too you need to work on this craft here also it may be a something skilled and very genuine and unique to you you need to hone it hone your craft you need to practice it you need to learn more you need to advance yourself put your head down and move forward you need there's an air of mystery still in regards to um this subject of career path or change or new job or learning a new skill they're still 
a whole sector that you have not taken either into account or you have just not learned about spirit says you need to learn it you can learn in, in, so the eights are about merging emerge yourself in it or merge yourself with it learn because this could be a very exciting uh endeavor for you you it's, it's something highly passionate it, it could be fashion it could be um, it could be design. It, it's something very, um, once again, unique and genuine to you and your experience. You have something to say here. The pages are about, you know, uh, a message, a spoken word here. It's something in regards to, yeah, just a new, a new way, a new endeavor. I'm going in a different direction, says the page of wands. In regards to what your passion and create creative juices get flowing for, it's it's newness here. Um. Okay. So let's see what the shells have to say. Message. Wow. We just talked about it. you have a message. Maybe you have something to say to the world. Newborn baby. It could be a business. And you know a business. A new business is like a newborn baby. Uh, lazy. What Spirit is asking you is to not be lazy. Do the work. Stop putting it. Picking it up. Putting it down. You know. Don't be lazy. We all can. Um, you know. Take a message from that. Right. Drama. This could be acting. This could be um something where there's an element of drama uh i'm here spirit could have it could have been something dramatic that shifted your focus away from one career path into another that's the only way the spirit was going to get you to move so we have ring maybe so a ring is a circle maybe you've done something over and over and over again something's happened something's been cyclical maybe you, you get a job can't stay in job something happens with job not even you but something external to you happens where that job is no longer and then you find yourself back doing this thing that you put down or you're back thinking about a business of your own it's been cyclical for you Spirit wants you to stick with it. But, uh, hunker down and get it done. Uh, caring. This could be uh, um, something you really care for. You could something in the element of caring, caring for other people. A caring message here that you have to give. You think something is hard or, or it can be hard. Starting a business is hard. Being an entrepreneur is hard. Being a independent contractor, whatever you want to call it, just being a self self motivated and a self starter sometimes can be hard because we can allow our focus to shift. Uh, we can allow life to shift us. So, uh, yes, it's hard, but get through it. Father. So we have maybe your father is playing a part in this someone is a father um maybe you can get some fatherly advice in regards to how to start this how to move in that manner in a, a more specific manner um self-care yeah put yourself first have at the bottom of this that we have heavenly signs we talked about that how you know, heaven shifted you, sh shifted focus with you. Maybe heaven had to come in and change your focus. There were signs that maybe you should be doing something else. You should be learning more or, or learning something else. You should pe be perfecting a specific craft that is yours and uniquely uh, and genuine to you and what you have to bring. To the table 
everything looks good it looks like your new person is coming in because you have done the work you have forgiven yourself you've forgiven others it looks like there may be some of you embarking on a new career path it says maybe in career or whatever in life and finance you have not had what you really wanted maybe you have not seen the ten of pentacles whatever that may be for you longevity long-term goals fulfilled uh good reputation money uh wealth because of fear of committing to one position and so you fe you fear committing to one position so you take how many is in that card you take two positions i need to have two jobs i need to have a job and side hustle i need to uh you know I need to be doing this and that now granted um how you amass wealth is to have different streams of income but if you have not perfected one stream and you have 10 streams then that is where you you have division within yourself within your goals um spirit doesn't know which stream to get behind you say, well, Spirit, get behind all of them. Well, you're only one person. Spirit knows better than you. You need to focus. Focus on one. Perfect it. Get expertise in it. And then you can start thinking about um, moving toward um, investment. Investment in, in another stream of income. Uh, in in, in uh, expanding your horizon but you haven't had what you wanted because of the constant shifts okay and your fear of committing to one position and the fear of committing to one position also can it can manifest in a way of okay so you say I'm committed to this I want to do my, I want to have my own business I'm gonna do this and it's just gonna be great and and it is great maybe for a few months maybe for a few years and then the wave comes the the wave of change the tidal wave of change and now you're scrambling and you're no longer committed to that position and you want to go elsewhere and you want to go back to or you want to sell or you want to you know you're just not committed anymore you have to be committed in the times of, of good and bad, says Spirit. Okay? All right. So, anyhow, that's for somebody. Let's go over to the website and talk about this for the next 72 hours. You need to make up your mind. What are you doing in regards to career and finance? Uh, there's someone coming in for some of you. You've done the work. There's no, not much more to do. You know, of course, life is everyday learning experience of keep you know learning keep forgiving keep you know uh, expanding but it looks like something or someone is coming in it could be someone from the past with the five of water here it could be someone new okay all right so let's go over to the website and kind of drill down on is it new is it old what does it look like when it comes in what should Aquarius be doing right now career and finance what can you do to help bring in usher in some real good energy all right so the link is below to get the extended reading it's also going to be in the comment section okay it's always um the extended reading has gone up okay only a few cents um with in increase in and merchant fees <laughs> this is the only way that I can see where we can continue to do the extended read but it will never be comparable to some other extended readings that others offer um, but it's still affordable um, take advantage of it if you can if you feel moved to it's 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 affordable okay all right, so the link is below. Thank you, guys. Take care.